what is the meanest thing that you've done or said to someone? Just take my hand and fly up through the dreams Where the skies are so clear With you I want to stay with you Hello people, you are so welcome to our space of Utopia today. We're in a different environment. Um, we are chilling with the birds, the monkeys, butterflies, nature, trees. <laughs> it's just a wonderful place. Um, we're not going to disclose the location because... <laughs> it's our secret location. Yeah, so um, today's um, episode is a game. And this game is called Hot Seat. So um, what we are going to do is ask questions and then if the person passes or doesn't want to answer or they can't answer or they don't know the answer to the question, they get to have a dare. So yeah, that's but why would you punish me for not knowing an answer to a question? It's knowledge. It's out there. You need to know. That goes for me too, because I'm sure there are questions that you might ask me and I have no answers to, or I don't want to answer, or, yeah. But this is personal knowledge though. Either way, we're going to get dared if you don't answer, so, <clears throat> yeah, that's what's up. Um, the first question is, besides bathing, what do you do naked? Go, 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 go. Besides bathing, what do I do naked? Yeah. I take my time, and by taking my time, I take Oh, and my they have to be three things. Okay, I'm sorry. They have to be really? three things, yeah. Uh, I would have shown you, but then you'd see the other. Anyway, I take my sweet time moisturizing every part of my body. Every part of my body. What else do I do naked? I shave. What else do, do people do naked? You tell us. What do I we... check myself out when I'm naked. Okay. Yeah, that's it. You're lucky. <clears throat> what is the biggest lie you've ever told without getting caught? So we need to know that lie today. But if I say the lie, yeah. I mean the whole world will get to know. Yeah. few moments later. I think I'm just going to prolong this for no reason, so I'll just go for a dare. Because really, I can't think of a lie. Honestly. So you twerk in front of people? Yeah, let's twerk it! <laughs> that's your twerking. That's yeah. the best you can do. Yeah. Oh but I twerked. That's the thing. Guys, please let us know. Rate <laughs> her from 1 to 10. How good or bad is her twerking? First of all, before you rate my twerking, remember there's no music. There's no hype. There's music. And this is a dare. Nah, I'm, I'm nah, 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 nah. It's already done. It's already done. What's the worst gift you've got and from whom? Oh my god. <laughs> to the person who will hear this, I am so sorry. You're willing to say? Yeah. No, actually, I'm not willing to say on second. Anyway, point. say, say. No, no. Say, say. We, get, we want the juice. We want the juice. We want the juice. Yes, just say. Roast the person so that they can do better next time. No, I've done enough of that. No. No, I'll actually do the dare. Seriously, just say. Come on, say, 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 we want to hear, say. Anyway, to the person, I am so sorry, I didn't want to say, but they don't want to do any there because I know Abby, she's going to give me a terrible, terrible thing mm -hmm. to do. That's right. And I know you're, you, you'll understand. Thank you. Um, I'm not a person who likes carrying jackets or heavy stuff. So when it gets cold, I really, it's not even freezing and shining. It's just, I carry light jackets. So I'm used to taking jackets from people. <laughs> so this person thought, since they like taking other people's jackets or borrowing, they'd buy me a very, an extremely heavy, heavy jacket. I'm trying to think who it is. Um, oh, but you have to tell us who it is. No, I don't have to tell you. Actually, who it is. that's the question. That's yeah, I'll do the day on that one. <laughs> mm -hmm. So yeah, I've never worn that jacket. It just sits there on my wardrobe. I don't even know where I'll ever wear it to. Like, it's just there. It's something I know I'm not going to use anytime soon. That's sad. Yeah. Okay, so who's your celebrity? Um, 
I don't. Zendaya. Zendaya. No, it has to be a man. Where does it have to be but a anyway, man? anyway, even Zendaya can work. No, you have to pull up your Instagram. Send her the most <coughs> embarrassing photo of yourself right now. Jokes when you don't have an embarrassing photo. Oh, I do have your embarrassing photo. I was waiting for that. So it's either you come up with your own embarrassing photo or I'll give you my embarrassing photo of you. Which still works for me. It's the one you, you sent yourself? Yeah. Uh, I'll do it. <laughs> I really love this. <laughs> do you want us to show people? Uh, no. Why? <laughs> actually don't mind oh you don't mind no. okay so you get to see which one was it this one yeah okay zindia will think i'm a creep <laughs> send it baby girl send it send her ah, it's done let me see i need to be sure ah! you can't delete i'm not deleting no you no, can't clarify Clarifying. No, I'm saying hi. No, you no, can't. Saying hi. You'll do that later. You can't do it now. Sawa. You 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 literally want to make me take away take away your phone. Can I trust you on that? You can do it later, but not now. Yeah, I'm not doing it. I'm going to make questions. I know she's coming for my neck. <laughs> what is the most surprising thing that has ever turned you on? Most surprising. Most surprising. Yeah. You were there in bed getting all freaky and whatever. And then this thing was done that turned you on. And it actually surprised you. <laughs> Guys, take notes. <laughs> oh. I bet mean, it's not freaky. Yeah, what is it? It's like someone sucked my toes. That was so good. You have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> but why do you ask me sex questions though? Like imagine in get to know you mm, sexually. Yeah. Maybe someone is out there eyeing you and they want to know how they want to please you. Really? Mm. Uh what else? Oh massaging the dimples on your back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's it. Really sexual questions. Yeah. People can already tell what you want to know. People see what your head thinks about. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the next question. What did you get in trouble for as a child? Oh my God, a lot. Yeah, tell us. The more the better. Overplaying. How? Like I used to play a lot. So explain. Like I used to run away. I come from school. I do not even put my things inside, I just dump them there on the field and play and play and play. I get I used to leave school at around five PM. I would play until seven PM. You are not picked up? No. My school was just like two minutes away, oh, three okay. minutes away. So I used to really play. Oh, I used to be beaten so much for playing. Mm -hmm. What else? <laughs> Licking sugar. <laughs> we all have. Yeah, what else? Um Oversleeping in the morning. Kai. I that gets her. That still walking. gets her in trouble. <laughs> I hated waking up in the morning. Oh my god. Mm -mm. I hated waking up in the morning. So I used to sleep, oversleep in the bedroom, go to the bathroom, sleep in the bathroom, and then my mom had to lock the bathroom for me to get out. Sleep in the bathroom. I slept in the bathroom. Wow, Oscars. Yeah. It was that bad. Wow. Mm hmm. Okay. What is the meanest thing that you've done or said to someone? I don't know. I, I really don't know. But I remember one time <clears throat> I had gone to a supermarket and there was this old aged woman who had bent over. <laughs> and I, I, I think I dropped a receipt that I had bought something. So I, I bent to pick it up. And then the woman thought probably that I took maybe money that had fallen from her pockets or something that that's just what i think in my head so she turns to me so angrily and then she's like let me see what you've picked i'm like it's not yours let me see what you you you've picked and then i was just like ah <laughs> and then she was like this these children of today are so disrespectful how could she do that to me how could she say ah 
and she sees I'm old enough to be her grandma. Hey, I was just like, you know, the meanest thing I've ever done. Mm -mm. Apart from the one you keep on telling people, oh, she never shuts up about this. Can and I tell people no, again? No, can't tell people that again. <sighs> like, just shut up. It's time. It was in primary. People used to put um, compasses, the set compasses on people's seat, and then someone comes and sits on it. But before someone sits on it, they used to remove it. So I decided that this one time I'm going to also do the thing. So I, before the guy came back, I put my compass, like we used to call it, you set it on the chair. So the boy came. And then at, uh, at some point I actually considered removing it and then I was like, nah, let me see what will happen. Like how deep can it go? It's just your ass. So <laughs> the guy sat down and I have never seen a boy in so much pain. I'm even embarrassed to say this, but anyway, it happened, it happened. If you're out then you remember this face and now I was a child. I am so sorry. I am really, really sorry. That was... A very bad thing. Imagine I really want to tell people what you did. No. Just shut up about it. <laughs> it's not even it was not even mean anyway. Moving on swiftly. What famous person do you consider to have a contagious laugh? Please. Please do this question justice. <laughs> Am I famous to be considered? Nah. <laughs> nah. A girl can dream anyway. <clears throat> Do a hundred people know you? A girl can dream. Yeah. A hundred people know you. I think so. You're sure? If I count my campus and my primary and my high school, I think a yeah, hundred people, people know, know you. Me. So yeah, so I'm famous. Oh, la yeah, la. I mean, yeah, yeah. Anyway, I, I think this guy, I don't know if you've, I don't think you've watched Money Haste, but this guy in Money Haste, um, I've forgotten his name, but he used to love, was it Denver? Denver. I'm not sure if it's Denver. I, how would they know? I've not watched Money Haste. I think it's Denver. I'm not sure. He had a German city. Yeah. His laugh is contagious. Ha 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 ha. I don't know how he loves. Okay. So for me, I, this is not my question, but I'll just answer because I feel like... She wants to do it I justice. can't relate. I can't relate to Denver. I haven't <coughs> watched. Mm -hmm. So I would say, first of all, Kenyan, the guy in East Meets West. Globally, I would say RuPaul. Hmm. I've never heard RuPaul laugh. He laughs so funny and it's so contagious. Like, the second you hear it, you'll be laughing. I promise you. What's the most embarrassing thing you've been caught doing? Does it have to be something cheeky? Mm, it has to be something embarrassing. Okay. So, <laughs> I... When I was little, I, I know some people will be like, you are little, it doesn't count. But when I was little, I went for a sleepover to my mom's friend house, friend's house. And then during that time, um, the woman had a son. Um, so mostly I would go there because of the son. So we were like, my mom and the friend were good buddies, like mm -hmm. really good. But then we formed a bond, me and the guy, I mean, me and the boy. I can't even remember. Where are you right now? <laughs> <laughs> if, you, if you see me, please reach out. Uh, so this guy, I went to the bathroom and then I had my towel on. And then <laughs> I thought at that particular moment I, I had the hallway and then I, you see like the bathroom. And then the hallway that leads to like the bedrooms. I thought I had the place to myself. So I was walking, cut walking. <laughs> mm -hmm. Which reminds me another story. I walked in on to on I walked on my teacher, cut walking for another teacher, 
say, don't you wish your girlfriend was hot like me? So I got the song from there and then I was catwalking saying, don't you wish your girlfriend was hot like me? And then I turned and my towel fell. Yeah. And when I turned, these things were happening simultaneously. The, the small boy came in. He came into the hallway and my towel was falling. So I felt like... I was little though, I didn't even have much development, but still I was so embarrassed, I couldn't even look at the guy again. <laughs> so this is the first guy who saw you naked? Technically, yes. Maybe my doctor was, the, the guy who delivered me was a man. No, I mean anyone who is not seeing me naked professionally. <laughs> Anyway, oh so that's it for today, guys. We hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please give this video a big, big, big thumbs, thumbs up. up. For those who've not subscribed, I don't know what you're waiting for. Like, join the family. Come on. Join us. And don't forget to come back for the next yeah, this is hottest episode in the two, five, four. <laughs> Bye, Bye, guys.